the more vulnerable I've gotten, the more real, the more honest, the more at peace I feel. Talk about enough already. Our pal, Val, Valerie Bertinelli, is back with us today. Her memoir is brilliant, and you will need a box of Kleenex. You're so raw, you're so real, mm. you're so open with people. It's such a, 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 a open and honest work. Thank you. I love you, Rachel. And I talk about you in the book, how much I love you and how much you mean to me. And <laughs> Yeah, but that's your creepy ethic. for me, so I'm not going to talk about that. No, I, <laughs> sorry that you had to read about yourself. But I needed you to know, and I needed everyone in the world who wants to read the book to know what mm -hmm. an amazing human being you are, your work ethic, your mm. your your brain, the way your mind works, the way <laughs> you create your artistry. I mean, you're just insane. I find this whole world that you talk about in this book so completely and honestly, I find this whole world so weird. Being a person of any kind of celebrity, it, it puts you on your heels. Yes, yes, it can. From the get go. No matter what it may look like from the outside that your, your, light, your life may be perfect. And you know when we look at other people and we're so envious of what they may have, we don't know the struggles that everyone goes through. And I think the main thing to remember is to be kind because you don't know what someone else's story is. You don't know what they're going through. You know, the whole world saw you, as you so openly write about, fall in love, be heartbroken, the stories of love and loss and ups and downs. How is this cathartic for you? Did this help? Has it helped? Oh gosh, so much. Oh, those pictures, so much. It, 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 I think, oh, I truly believe we are only as sick as our secrets. And I just don't wanna be sick anymore. I, I don't wanna hold stuff in. That's a big And it's baby. so much easier to not, to not be secretive. I mean, when, when we, let it out when we can be vulnerable. Like Brene Brown says, there is strength and there is power in radical vulnerability. And I have noticed the more vulnerable I've gotten, the more real, the more honest, the more at peace I feel, the more I'm not trying to pretend, I'm not trying to pretend to be this perfect human being that I've never been and that's okay, nobody's perfect. But as long as we're trying and we're learning and we're creating and we're being kind to ourselves and to other and being respectful, that's all we can really ask for. And I'm, I'm hoping that what people get out of this book too is it's not just about me. I mean, yeah, they're my stories. And, and, but what I go through, and I, I say it in the beginning that I want people to take this book and every time I say I or me, I want them to replace that with themselves and think, well, how is the story similar to what I've gone through? What is the grief that I'm feeling that I have felt in my life, the pain that I've felt in my life, or the joy? And how do I be intentional about that and 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 get to that again today? Or just anything it may be that makes you feel that you can relate to this is what I'm hoping for. I love you and I congratulate I love you, you on a really serious piece of work here where Thank you're you. just so open with people.